my review of Sharknado 3. Um, I watched it on sci-fi, it was world premiere. At first everything was normal, so he got a medal for saving New York and Los Angeles. Then the Sharknado happened. Everything cool with it. Um, okay. I'm not gonna do the whole movie. Um, besides, this was you seen this all in the trailer. This part I just now talked about. In any in any case, if you didn't see the trailer, I'm sorry. It got a little bit spoiled. Um, please stop watching right now. Otherwise, you're gonna get more spoiled because I'm gonna talk about the biggest problems that that made this movie crap. The first two were better. So within 20 seconds, um, if you don't leave, you will be spoiled. If you're watching this because you want to get spoiled, okay, I'm fine with it. But if you're watching this to get spoiled, to spoil your friends, you're an asshole. So leave. Anyway, let's start. The things that really bothered me. Like really bothered me. First, okay, I got I got a thing that they need to go to space, so that they're, you know, I forgot the, the my English isn't perfect. You have a space shuttle, things that the things that fall off, um, the gas things. So to let that explode, okay, I got it. But couldn't you just use bombs? So that failed. So his father, he had um, a Star Wars program with laser. You use the laser to to wipe out the entire hurricane. Okay, I got that, and the ex it worked. Oh look, it's a laser. No, the, the laser should at least have made heat waves, destroying things, just just the hurricanes, um, tornadoes. Okay, then I know a Star Wars movie is coming out. I want to see it. I definitely want to see it. I'm a huge Star Wars fan. Well, if you're checking my room, you probably can see that I'm a Star Wars fan. I don't have that much of Star Wars. Maybe a helmet somewhere from when I was a child. Not gonna look after it. Uh, anyway. Um, come on. First movie, he got eaten by... Oh no, wait. I'm gonna do that later. Okay, there is a Star Wars movie coming out. They made Two Star Wars references. We had like a Star Wars project. Okay. The second thing. A lightsaber chainsaw. Maybe it it would have worked in Star Wars episodes 8 or 9. Not in Sharknado. Come on. Second of all, before this happens. Sharks flying into space. The destroying the entire space shuttle. There is no oxygen in space. They can't breathe without water. But somehow, if I hear it right, the sharks were learning to survive in the air so okay but it was like um, rain clouds so there is water in it okay I get that gravity sharks don't need gravity no sharks can just without any rocket while a laser destroys everything fly off into space to then destroy a shuttle, get killed by a lightsaber chainsaw, 
yeah, come on. If you want to rip off Star Wars, do it with something else. Not just make a lightsaber chainsaw. Oh yeah! The chainsaw he got in the beginning of the movie. The oath to the golden chainsaw users or something. I forgot the name. It was the first at the beginning of the movie. The movie is now done for about maybe an hour. Okay. Anyway. Um, then again, his father landed up on the moon. And if you check around him, there are sharks on the moon. That's not the most terrible part. Okay, they were already in space, they already blew it up. It's when when the space shuttle got destroyed. So his wife, Finn's wife, and Finn himself got eaten by a shark in space. So Earth Space Station Shark eating them here. Well, they're out of gravity. Normally, you should just like. Phew. And shark returns to Earth. Where then he got burned. If a meteor this big gets. Phew, nothing anymore by landing on the ground before. How the hell? This is just a shark. Only got a few holes in it. Then he made he made, with his parachute from his su suit. Okay, I get that. It's it was already destroyed. The entire movie was already destroyed. They just destroyed it. Then his wife um, got birth from the baby because she was pregnant in the shark while flying from space to earth with a, in a shark she had a baby there so they were happy they survived and then a part of the sh space sh shuttle and then on top on on top on her so you think because she look up this this part comes down she looks up and there that's the end the credits If you're going to ruin your entire franchise, you just have to just stop with at a second because this movie was crap. Honestly, if I should buy it, because I don't think I will, um, then the only reason why I would buy it is to like um, smash it, frisbee with it. If I'm rich, yeah, maybe. Do the dishes with it. Well, that will be lame. Make a hole in it. Put a rope on it. To make a, a necklace, um, you know, like this. But except with the pins. Like um, a necklace, yeah, a necklace, and just give it to somebody who wants a necklace and doesn't have money. Like here, you can watch it, maybe. Maybe it will still be watchable after it's real old and yeah, maybe. That's what I'm gonna do with crappy movies from now on. Make necklaces out of it or frisbees. Okay, this movie. On the first half, it was good. Not gonna complain. Um, that was the most, the most hardest part that disturbed me. Now, the smaller things that disturbed me. Well, they were on the the rail thing. Mainly, anyway, it's not that good. I know. The shark kept. A normal object would slow down if they do this, they would just like 
this jar gains speed from it. Like. Eat a person. On an attraction. Nope. The other thing was in the. I think it was an F16 or whatever the plane thing. So they destroyed the, the shark, a shark NATO because there are multiple in this movie. But then got hit by the last shark. They have the uniforms on, they land in the water. Then they come on, out with just their underwear. Why? Why? So you're under the water. So probably water comes in. I have an idea. Before we escape, I'm gonna take off all my clothes. Lame. This movie sucked. It's... Mm, I'm gonna say it's, it's... Dragon Ball Evolution was better. Yeah. If you... If you seen Dragon Ball then then what Dragon Ball Evolution Dragon Ball Evolution was better if you watch Sharknado 1 and 2 then watch 3 3 sorry you're still gonna say Dragon Ball Evolution was better there's no fucking way I just watched that movie yesterday again so my friend bought it and oh, okay let's watch it and I just watch it again it's crap anyway this movie got a 3 out of 10. If we were in the middle, it had it still had a 7. So the the traction thing lame. The ball thing okay. If you have a pregnant wife in a ball that flipping, then gets in a tornado standing on a tower. Oh yeah, the baby's going to be just fine. Because you can hold on, like on a high speed, killing sharks with it. There it dropped and dropped. It got a little bit better. Then, phew, like the shark falling down back on earth. It sucked. This is my computer, my camera is... Um, the batteries are dead, and I forgot the charger for, for, for it with my friend because the internet connection is better there, most of the times, anyway, and I'm almost ever, always there, so, like, it's like, my, you can say it's my, my, my YouTube studio there, because this is my room, it needs to be decorated. I have my mangas and my CDs here in this part. I'm gonna make a video of this later. And starting next week, I'm gonna do a weekly cheap manga buy thing. Because. Uh, you can see them laying. Here are my mangas. Around somewhere here are my cities. So I need more mangas. I know. But well anyway, I'm gonna talk about this later. I stop the video now. Sharknado, you ruined the movie.